Hey, hey, happy Friday. Uh, yeah, back at it. Vlogging another week of training. If you haven't, check out uh, the video I just posted last Friday. But anyways, today is a rest day, usually Fridays my, and Mondays. I have rest days. And because of that, uh, as you see, I've just been catching up on some breathing work and catching up on some functional strength work, trying to balance out and get my body ready to do some weights here and there, not doing anything like crazy heavy. Uh, I already talked to my coach about that, but that's something that I'm just kind of starting on, just get my body in the mindset, in the mood, ready for that stuff to come in the next couple of weeks. Uh, right now, uh, I'm going to head out for a walk. I always find it's good on days off just to kind of get moving a little bit. You know, that I realized uh, in season when I'm doing big volume, I'm usually doing a recovery spin every Monday and Friday, you know, 60 minutes. I seem to respond really well to that. But on days when I'm actually not riding, which right now we're not doing high volume, I think, uh, you know, I got the testing week coming up this week. But right now I'm just going to be uh, not riding today. So I'm going to go do a casual walk, get the blood flowing. Always feels good. And then, and then I don't know what's after that, but it's testing week. Super excited. Uh, Monday, I meet my coach again, talk about what's going to go on with the tests. I mean, everything's kind of laid out already in my training plan. But this weekend's supposed to rain to you. Anyways, this is my Friday. Uh, doing grocery shopping to you today because food is key. I'm uh, gonna try making some carrot mushroom soup tonight. So actually, before I dive into uh, making that food, uh, I wanted to actually talk a little bit about where I get these ideas for dinners and meals and just overall nutrition and how I kind of help myself with uh, staying on track. So. Maryland, I was 145 pounds. Fantastic, race weight. Um, off season hit, two weeks off the bike, not really caring too much. Uh, Gain a little bit of weight, back up to like 155. I know, 10 pounds, it's a lot. But at the same time, I actually can trim out pretty quickly, so I'm not super worried about it. But what I use for uh, just kind of trimming out and whatnot is the racing weight cookbook. I really like that book. That one is super solid. There's lots of good recipes in there. It's all like wholesome food, lean meats, things like that. Um, they have, I mean, everything gives you a good range and variety of what you need in order to stay healthy. So uh, that's what I use. Uh, I would highly recommend checking that out. Uh, you can find it on Amazon, whatever. Anyways, that's where I got the idea for this carrot mushroom soup. Uh, I'm actually making it for the first time since it's fall. I wanted to make some more fall type dishes. So uh, yeah, after this walk, let's go do that. we got the food out of the way. Let's talk testing week. Uh, this is what we're doing for testing week. We're going to be laying it out with, I'm doing a five minute max power test. I'm going to be doing a 20 minute max power test, a 15 second sprint max power test. And then I will also be wrapping it up with a one minute max power test. Uh, I talked to my coach today. It is Monday, rest day, taking a chill. Tomorrow, do some endurance. Then I started the testing. But chatting with my coach, we were kind of talking about some soft targets, if you would, for the five minute and for the 20 minute, because the one minute doesn't matter, you just go max. Uh, 15 seconds, just give it what you can get. But the five minute and the 20, you can sometimes 
overpace those and just blow up and have a worse test than what you could have had. So for the five minute, we're gonna look at maybe 415 to 440, somewhere in that range. And then for the 20, uh, looking at doing 330 to 350, somewhere in that range. But that's kind of the goal. So uh, let's fast forward to Wednesday and jump on the bike. Okay, five minute test. Here's what we got going on. 90 second warm up is what we're doing right now. We are doing 90 seconds at threshold. Don't know what my threshold is, so I'm gonna be doing them around 330. Just figured uh, safer is better. Uh, we'll do three of those, three minute rest. That should open up my legs nicely. Then we'll do a five minute rest after the last one, and then we will jump straight into the five minute test. And goal, soft targets for that is 415 to 440. How will I pace that? Well, I'm not gonna go out of the gate and do four or 500. <laughs> so uh, it's gonna be first minute, probably trying to hover around 460 and then just kind of let the power come to me, start to fade a bit, try to hang on, push through in the last 45 seconds. That's what it's gonna be like. It's gonna be awful. My arms are gonna tingle. My scalp is gonna tingle. Everything's gonna be on fire. I'm gonna feel like I wanna puke when I'm done. Gonna be out of breath. But regardless of what happens, that's what I gotta do. Let's jump in it. Dude, that sucks. Oh. Dude, my arms, my arms, my legs, everything burns. Massive burn. Gosh, that was hard. Oh. Dang it, I'm so bummed. I wanted to do at least like 410, 415. Oh. 400 will have to be the number. So when you take two weeks off the bike or just rest in general, especially when you stop riding, the one thing that you lose the fastest is your VO2 max. I don't want to ride anymore.
Happy Thursday. Today we're doing the 20 minute test. I'd love to say that I'm excited to do this. Well, uh, I am excited and I'm not at the same time. Totally not excited. So we shall see how today goes. Uh, yesterday's test was actually pretty good. Wasn't terrible. Happy with it. 400 watts, what can you say? Today, yeah, today's gonna be interesting. We're gonna try where uh, I'm going to try and do, I don't know, 330 to 350. That's gonna kind of be the goal. So see what we can do. Let's go uh, get a warm up in and then uh, I'm just gonna jump right into the test. So enjoy watching me suffer. The test, dude, it was so good. Oh my gosh. Oh, 349, 349. Oh, I'm so excited. To give you context, last year, ah, uh, last, gosh, my stomach hurts so bad. Last year, after my two weeks off, I could barely do 3.30 for 20 minutes. So coming into the off season, uh, actually my meeting this with my coach, we were talking about power targets. And he was like, you know, I think, I think the big base we did last year, along with the season, a quick little rebuild before Maryland, like I'm hanging on to some of that fitness a little better than in years past. So even though I took, a week before I went off the bike, I was on antibiotics for like a infection, which kills, kills blood blood cells and whatnot. And then I took two weeks off and then got a week of easy riding. And then week two, we jumped into testing. This is my first legit hard 20 minute effort, or even just yesterday, obviously the five minute, but this is my first like long one. And uh, dude, I'm so taxed. I'm so taxed right now. Anyways. Uh, yeah, that was my first legit 20 minute hard effort. But man, I thought I was gonna hit 350 there for for a bit, but I have the stomach issue. It builds right in here. I don't know what it is. It's about seven, eight minutes in. It hits, starts to build, and then it builds here and I actually was burping a little bit. I mean, I wonder if it's like GERD or acid reflux or something, but uh it limits me a lot of times but i was able to like settle in and like s keep pushing to where like my legs were also wanting to give out so i knew i was on my limit and just pushed and held on holy crap that was intense yes 
so dang excited. 348, all right, 20 minutes, 348. Uh, dude, I think that's it, that's all I got. I mean, I gotta get this video out now and drop it to you guys, so. Oh, let's cut out the rest of this ride with some beautiful scenery. You look how pretty it is right now. I'm up here kind of by Gettysburg area. But anyways, man, let's uh let's cut out with some beautiful stuff from this ride and then uh yeah. Tune in next week and you'll see my one minute, my 15 second power test, and then uh see what my coach has to say and tell you my new zones and kind of go forward from there. So